Hi folks, I got a bit mud on the old sluice today and um, it's not fiberglass but I did the sanding and the filling. Um, I'm going to wax it and then I'm going to put another release agent on it which is which is a recipe I found on the internet which is turpentine and Vaseline mixed. I'll be able to paint it on or spray it on with airbrush or something like that. Uh, what I will say is uh, I had a, a friend of mine round last week, <laughs> Mr. Mario, the prospector, and he went to Mun Munchen, I think it was Munchen, where they had a, a festival for uh, yeah, a lot of um, uh, minerals and stuff like that, and he fetched me another bag of winter wet. <laughs> Uh, I think you went, didn't you, Jürgen? Jürgen Kruger, my friend. I think you went, didn't you? So that's from there. It's the original sand. Lovely. But anyway, I'll get on with this. That should be nice. So, guys, I'm going to get on with this. <laughs> I'm going to attempt to uh, fill it and finish sanding it. I, I, didn't, I took it downstairs and filed it. And, I didn't want to get sand going downstairs, so I'm going to do that. What I've got to alter, I did notice, and some, I appreciate guys who uh, commented on last one. I've got to get rid of that. <laughs> I'm never going to get that out. So I'm just going to block that up, and what that'll be is, because that's where my miner's moss or carpet's going to go in anyway. So what I'll do is just bring that flush there, close that up, and so then I'll, say, I'll, I'll get it filled. I'm going to go with uh, household plaster and I did mention before that I thought about filling this with foam I'm not going to because again if it is really difficult to get out as it's only hot glued I'll be able to collapse it without completely destroying it hopefully and uh, we'll see how we go I did actually think about making a two part off this but then, if I did that, it means to cast another one, I need twice as much material. And, or more, <laughs> three times, because obviously this, what comes off this would be the sluice. So, I'd have to take a two-part foot sluice, then make another one of these from inside, if you know what I mean, in fiberglass, then take a sluice off that. <laughs> so no but uh, I'll see what I get done today and uh, hopefully I'm, I don't think I'll be casting it next week If well, dirt casting it um, for me next week because I'm, I've got some stuff to do on Saturday helping me to moving house so oh, well, it might, I might get it done Sunday but if Sunday's weather's good I'm going in the woods Incidentally, check this channel out. That's a fail. I don't know how I managed to get all that air in it. I, 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 re, uh, I reinvigorated the sand, so I think I got some steam in it. Might have been a little bit wet in that area. I've got to try that again. So, that's that. <laughs> I've got to sand it, obviously. Uh, good thing about uh, using plaster is that I can use these specialised tools and get into all the bits that I needed to get into <coughs> apart from it sands down well I'm going to go and get air dryer now and hurry the process along and then what I'll do is uh, I'll look for any parts where it shrinks because it does shrink I'll fill that in and um, check it over and it should sand down nicely but I will have to put a coat uh, um, and put coat of PVA glue over it. Other good thing about this, in my reckoning, is that if it pops out into actual sluice itself, it'll be easy to clean out with a wire brush. <laughs> you know what I mean? Say, so, I wouldn't want to do that with car body filler. Don't mind doing it with plaster. So guys. I've made a release agent, I found this on the internet, uh, turpentine and Vaseline. I spray that on after I've waxed it, it's like a double co-wax for waxing it. 
I'm going to put this on it first to get my colour. And I've tested a different piece to this. I've actually bought this. It's uh, it's um, wood barrier, but I'm going to test it. On, I'll test a bit of resin on that as well first, just to make sure it doesn't melt. But it shouldn't do uh, because it's, I think it's the same material. But I will test it. If not, it could be green, not black. But I quite like that. Obviously, it won't come out as good as that because I've got it very pressed into all them uh, gaps. So that's filled, sanded, and it's had a coat of um, PVA to seal it. Yeah, stable. So I'll say I'm not going to get it done this week. I was hoping to get down to the river today, but it didn't happen. I've been working in garden. That's something that I've been putting off, unfortunately. And it is something I enjoy garden, but uh, playing in the river is much more fun. So look forward to part three and I will hopefully be glassing it. I got the Kelsey blues, Kelsey blues. I didn't get